first, as you know, Unistan is a student, rep uh, student um, of Unistech, and we have last year made Unistan Global from five countries that we will share our cooperation and collaboration for Unistan locals. So this year we got together and we discussed uh, how to improve Unison Local and what we want to do in Unison Global. So as a result, we made some documentation of Unison Global and a roadmap. It's just the first draft. So we had some short presentations of what happened in the past year. And we had Peru, Ghana, Korea, and Japan. Uh, we had a Skype meeting that was uh, going to happen with Nigeria, but it didn't uh, work out. Right after our short presentations, uh, we talked about how to improve Unison Local. So this also included event management, so how to manage all these Unison Global together, and how to manage Unison Local within our community. And such uh, issues like funding of organizations, since we will need some funding within Unison Global and Unison Local. So we went over the vision of Unison Global, and if I can read out, it would be activate space development in cooperation and competition of Unison of all regions. So this is to give impact to the uh, Unison community as local and global together. So Unison local means Unison each country. And another one is to challenge international missions we cannot achieve alone. And we came up to a result that we should uh, come up with missions that will give influence to uh, the global in a good way. So we, we sat down and um, we discussed about what we should do first. And we came up with, let's make a roadmap, because there should be something that is actual uh, so for Unison Global to actually happen. So our first draft of roadmaps include management. And in management, uh, we wanted to carry out online meetings regularly instead of every annual year. So in this year, we will start from December, and this will go on ev every month. So since we are in Peru and in Africa and in Asia, uh, we had some discussion on who will sleep first and who will sleep later. And in administrative structure of Unison Global, uh, we wanted to know who to contact. So we talked about some preliminary um, structure of our Unison Global in local and global community. And then comes the management of the next Unison Global. Since in until now, Unison Global was all uh, done by great effort by Unison Japan, uh, we wanted to help. So next year, uh, we could help Unison Global organize some activities. And then, of course, that means making homepage of Unison Global. So some actual projects. So this is what we're makes all students in, um, happy. Uh, we, we have some actual projects that should go together and it will influence all Unison Global and non-Unison Global to join in to our Unison Global community. So we had some short-term projects and long-term projects. So short-term means maybe within five years. So for example, Korean students can organize Unison Korea and join Kansat competition of the Noshiro Space Event and this will be some kind of communicative collaboration between Japan and Korea. And in 2016, we came up with an idea of uh, having a joint Kansat project. And uh, this can be done by 2016. And long-term projects will be, of course, we will use space technology to solve global problem. And last but not least, uh, we had some logistics. So, so this meant management tools, how we will manage local and global unison. And we discuss good solutions to communicate with each other. As you, as you know, uh, Skype maybe once or twice is okay, but many times a year it could be uh, not help. It could be uh, sleeping, and and some documentation should be fixed. And we wanted to make a database structure. 
So, uh, next meeting is 2014, December 27th. Uh, time to be determined and using Skype. So, this will be our first online meeting. Thank you very much.